Here with Jess, uh, we're just wondering uh, where, where he's where taking going? us. I'm wondering too. Right. <laughs> so we're going to a property that I haven't been to the music now. I haven't been to it for, uh, let's say a decade, nearly. It's been nine and a bit years since I've been to this property. Right. Um, I've, I've been warned what we're going to find. And uh, this is going to be a test of my relentless positivity. Okay. Ten um, years since you last. Ten years since I last right. found it, and I'm, I'm driving there now. Uh, I'm not a hundred percent sure where it is. Um, I I wouldn't normally come and do this visit. I'm doing it just for you guys, as in to, to get the video done. Um, it's a property that uh, we just had to kick the tenants out of. We got the keys back two two working days ago. It's been a weekend as well, but uh, two working days ago. Um, the place isn't in a very good state. I bought some flea spray cam. Oh, yeah. okay. I didn't tell you that, did I? We're gonna have to. Uh, yeah, socks in the trousers, uh, trousers in the socks, flea spray. Great. And um, there's a couple of rotting out cars on the front drive. Uh, I think a few animals have been living in the house, or, or without my permission, of course. You know all those kind of things. Um, so a real challenge. Oh yeah, yeah. It's going right. to be. Uh, it, yeah, we, we've had a tenant not paying their rent for uh, three months or so. We had to kick them out with a bailiff. This is about as bad as it gets. And uh, I've still got a smile on my face because uh, I bought the house for fifty grand. It's now worth one hundred and twenty. Um, I have to say, ten years ago, my oh, I think I've just gone past it. Come on, really? I've got no idea where this place is. <laughs> We'll I'm going to turn it, right up here, it must be. We'll yeah, put her in the maps yeah, and we'll yeah, find we'll put it. In the maps. Um, yeah, our referencing has got a lot better over the last decade, for sure. I don't think this person would have, I know, they wouldn't have passed referencing. However, I might still have taken it. It was a weird situation. You had a mum and two grown-up sons living there. One of the sons with, with, was with um, a partner. It's a four-bedroom house. Mm -hmm. It's quite hard. It's not hard to get rid of a four-bedroom house, but it's hard, no. hard to get rid of it for the four bed money. You can rent it as a three bedroom house, but it's a four bedroom house. And these tenants have been paying me £150 above what I thought the market rate was because um, of their less than ideal circumstances. They basically didn't pass referencing and I, uh, I made an exception, but they paid £150 a month. Right. More. So, right. you know, what's that? Uh, 50... That's only 20 grand? £20,000 extra, £18,000 extra. Now, yeah. you know, I'm, I'm definitely going to be paying, uh, I, I reckon we're into, well, it's definitely four, maybe five figures to fix this place up. But you bought it for 50 grand. Yeah. And it's not worth a little bit more than a double. Yep. Yeah. And you're also uh, been getting And I've been some getting rental. the extra rent. Yeah. Um, I could have handled things slightly different in the period and nowadays with a different tenant I, I think we would have done. Um, having to kick a tenant out is expensive um, but as long as you get all the paperwork in place it's, yeah. I wouldn't say it's easy but you know it, it's a straightforward process and um, yeah okay. I'm, I'm, I'm reasonably relaxed. We'll see what we find shall we? Fantastic. Can you cut that off and put it in the sat nav because I've got no idea where we are. <laughs> Hello. Left onto Road. I'd never have found this place. I know where it is now, but I'd never have found it. And then it's the, it's the next left after that, isn't it? Yes. Yeah. Cool. I, I, love the, I love this kind of stock. I love this. Well, we bought houses on this Take road here. Left onto Ambleside Road, then turn and, left and, and onto this road house, we're talking about the house I'm going to now, I, I can't remember the exact number, but it was, I don't know if it was 48 or 52,000 pounds. I could look it up, but it hardly seems worthwhile. Yeah. And, they're now um, 100 to 120. I've got a couple back there that, yeah, if we paid 52, they're now worth 130 maybe. You know? When do you purchase the uh, so this the one? Original. 10 years ago, about 10 years ago. Right, yeah. so, so 10 years, a double in a bit. Yeah, double in a bit. We've arrived. Let's get looking inside. We need to uh, we need to suit and boot and get these things on, but have a look at the, can you tell which one's mine? <laughs> look at that place. Wow, here we go. Oh, there's a mini in there. So we are uh, ready. Cam, um, Cam just said, uh, where's the flea spray? And I thought he'd brought it in. He thought I'd brought it. So Send off his face. So all we've done so is... So our preparations are as this. follow. <laughs> and, we, and we said, let's go in. And if we see fleas all over our feet, I mean, there might not be any, but... Hopefully not. And um, we've got a couple of cars here, sort of. I mean, uh, you'll have to 
So this, uh, oh, so I think that's, that might be worth some money, maybe. It's a car. one car there. And this one, the, the Mini's gone. And a Mini. But it's got little holes. I, don't so, think, so, I think they're, we're going to be charged. So three cars um, in the driveway. Cam was just asked me a really good question. He said, Jess, why did you let it get like this? How did you let it get like this? And um, so a couple of things. So first of all, the, the, the within two months of you know, the very first inspection we did, it became clear they weren't looking after the places that they should have done. Um, and we made really good attempts to try and get them and they, they, they improved things uh, obviously at the point when we start kicking them out and that's taken three months right. it's got progressively worse and it is pretty bad now do you know the main point is when we go in there and we might be a little bit sick mm, okay but I, I would uh, imagine gather the smell a bit yeah. I would imagine yeah. it's not as bad as it looks okay you know um, you're going through it I, I, you know Damien contracts manager came around and he said oh you've got 20 grand to spend in that place I bet we don't. Okay. You watch. So let's let's go in. Okay. You ready? All right. Let's go. Let's go. That smell hits you. If this was smell vision it'll win the price. Wow. So. Oh yeah, we might need a new kitchen. So there's a thousand pounds plus five hundred pound fitting. Because it'd be exactly the same kitchen in the same place. It might clean up. You never know. Oh no! <laughs> it, needs new, it needs a new kitchen. There's a lot of stuff that needs clearing out. Now it smells pretty bad and it looks pretty bad. But there's no plaster peeling off the walls. No. All of that will just redecorate up. It is ten years. You know, um, I would say that a kitchen would normally last longer than ten years, actually. But obviously, this one hasn't. Mm -hmm. you know? Let's go through into this room. Again, in here, you can stick this lot in a skip, decorate, and you're done. Yeah? I think so. Yeah? No major structural damage. Well, no, just, no, uh, no damage. This is just, and this is just how some people live. And yeah, I, sadly though. No. Yeah, do you know what? Yeah, yeah. It's um, it's a little bit chaotic and crazy and you know, a little bit hoardery. Um, let's go upstairs, shall we? I'm, I'm, right now, I'm ripping stuff out, decorating, putting new carpets down. Um, I've, got, I've got something stuck to my shoe. I don't know quite what it oh, is. Good. Uh, uh, there you go. Let's just leave it. So the clue, the clue to this tenant, um, sort of maybe that they might not be looking after it as, as we wanted them to, but, um, you know, within six months was they'd opened a pet taxi business. So, right. you know, go on, you have a little look around in here. It's, it's clearing out and decorating. Whoa, the bathroom. Yeah, we'll, uh, uh, we'll not show you. No, no, we will. Shall we? Yeah, we're not going to shy away from that. It's the okay. best bit. Everybody. Please brace yourselves. One, two. That's your toilet. Come on. Whoa, that's not the worst I've seen. Not by a long way. Look. Come on. Yeah. Here we go. So that's Jess uh, removing some of the fleece. Only one. I've only found one. Just the one flea. So he says. Let's go find some spray, don't you? Yeah. There's only one. one. Yes. What are the? Um, I wouldn't say positives, but what? How would you? How would you describe this? How would you turn it into a positive mentality? Yeah, I can. Okay. So that's the worst I've ever seen. Right. That's as bad as it gets. Right. Um, we kind of knew it when we let a tenant in. I'm not sure if I'd have let that tenant in there now. Although I might have done, to be honest. It's been as it hasn't been as bad as that, that that happened in three months, but it was always not really well looked after uh, within you know, six months, a year of the tenant moving in there. Bear in mind, I kind of knew about this and we were getting £150 a month rent more. Um, I'm a bit itchy. Yeah, me too. Yeah. Big time. Yeah. I think it's psychological. Perhaps. Think, yeah, yeah. Um, so, you know, I don't feel like I'm out of pocket for that place. It's gone mm -hmm. up in value. I, I chose it well. And like I say, it's as bad as it gets. Um, that is the second, so this year we've kicked two tenants out in this way.
the year before that, none, the year before that, none, the year before that, one. You know, this happens very, very in infrequently. Uh, the damage in there is, is it's superficial. You know, there's not a lot extra actually to do. It will cost me, I think, £5,000 to get rid of the stuff and redecorate it. I've got a deposit, oh, that's the other thing, I've got the old deposit rules and I've got more deposit because it was previous and we did ask for more deposit. Um, so I think, my, I think we've got a £1,000 deposit, so I might be in for, for four grand. i have got all the other costs and expenses. But like I say, out of uh, 200, well it would be more than two, 200 properties odd, um, but more than 200 tenancies because some have moved in that time, I've had this twice this year and that's unusual, uh, on an average of less than once a year. So um, yeah, I, part of being a, being a landlord isn't it? I think honestly I could have probably done a bit more, mm -hmm. I know my management team probably would well they wouldn't have stood for this anymore um, we'd have dealt with it a little bit sooner but then as a landlord I'm thinking well they've done what they've done um, and at that time they were paying the rent so uh, would I just have just have lived with it right um, yeah so moving forward refurbishments yeah and vet the tenants yeah which you thoroughly. know we do, we do that now anyway but even with vetting tenants behaviors can change and yeah yeah but yeah, yeah. Um, at the point when I get an inspection report showing something as bad as that, I'll think twice about kicking them out. Right. But they were paying the rent. Right. And it was more than I was expected. So. Five grand, ten, um, uh, three weeks, four weeks, and I'm counting the fact that I know that the guys can't start for a week or so anyway. And back on the market, you know this area, Cam, it'll rent for more money. Sure. And it'll be gone pretty damn quick, won't it? It will. Yeah. Okay. I'm happy. Right.